Hey guys, I was here bringing you a Poke Analysis on Dino. Looking at the Smog on sets, or Smog on set, it's a Choice Scarf set with the ability Hustle, uh, with a jolly or hasty nature, with normal IVs and EVs of 20 HP, 236 attack, 36 defense, and 236 speed, with the moveset of Crunch, Outrage, Fire Fang, Ice Fang, or Draco Meteor. Now, the Smog on set that you be should run a Jolly Nature if you plan on having your last move slot being Ice Fang, but a Hasty Nature if you're planning on your last move slot being Draco Meteor. What this set does is capitalize on the fact that it hits at least 14 speed, meaning it can run an effective Choice Scarf set, outspeeding everything that's unboosted. Hustle is the main thing here, essentially giving you a Choice Band boost to all your moves. But I only see the problem that the moves such as Fire Fang, Ice Fang, don't have the 100% accuracy, which means they're going to be even less likely to hit. So far, it's a good offensive set, but it's very risky, kind of like Darumaka, in the fact that it also gets Hustle. But looking at the custom sets I made, uh, the first set is a Phaser slash Stall Breaker, with item of Eviolite Light or Focus Sash, the ability Hustle, a Jolly Nature, with normal IVs, EVs of 100 HP, 76 attack, 36 defense, 36 special defense, and 216 speed. With the moveset of Roar, Taunt, Crunch or Outrage, and Toxic or Thunder Wave. Now the whole Phaser slash Stall Breaker thing is literally to phase out opponents who have successfully set up on you, or to taunt potential supporters. Crunch and Outrage are the stab moves here, however I would recommend Crunch seeing as Outrage locks you in. And Toxic and Thunder Wave are here just as a utility. I would recommend Toxic if you're gonna go with Crunch, and Thunder Wave if you're going to go with Outrage, considering there's a chance for para hacks. Now, looking at the second set I made, it's a Parafusion Flinch set. This is absolutely diabolical. Its item is Eviolite with the ability Hustle, an Impish Nature, with normal IVs, 100 HP, 76 attack, 116 defense, 36 special defense, and 132 speed, with a moveset of Swagger, Substitute, Thunder Wave, and Bite or Dragon Rush. Here's what this set does. It literally comes in, Thunder Waves your opponent, then goes to Swagger, which it's actually not that bad considering Hustle will only affect moves that have physical hits, such as uh, Bite or Dragon Rush. However, it won't affect moves such as Substitute or Thunder Wave, obviously because Substitute isn't a fighting move, but Thunder Wave because it's a supporting move. Uh, this also goes for special moves such as Draco Meteor. But, like I was saying before, go for Thunder Wave, go for Swagger. You can feel free to set up a substitute at that point, and then go for Bite. Bite has a 30% chance of flinching, which is great considering that Dino does get stabbed with it. Dragon Rush has a 20% chance of flinching, but with Hustle, its accuracy is less than reliable. So I would really recommend Bite. But if you really feel lucky and you want to go for that extra power, by all means, go for Dragon Rush. Before I finish with this set, I want to explain the IVs a little bit more. You see, with the IVs, it's not necessarily to have a lot of attack, just moderate attack, considering Hustle will do the rest. You want to have a little bit of speed, just so that way when things are incredibly boosted, like say, Weasel with Swiss Swim, um, there's actually a chance it could outspeed a Dino with absolutely no speed investment. And the defense investment is just in case, because you are raising your opponent's attack. So that's it for this poke analysis. I hope you guys got some ideas off that. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge.